Hi, my name is Alderin Ordell, and I'm the owner of WaterForLifeUSA.com. We are the exclusive distributors for EOS water ionizers, so if you want to take a look at our selection, please visit us at www.WaterForLifeUSA.com. Today we're going to be talking about alkaline water drops, and we're going to be asking the question, are they worth your money? Are you considering alkaline water drops to try to make yourself healthier? You may be surprised to learn that, despite marketing claims, they aren't very effective. Here are the top three reasons to not buy alkaline water drops. The first reason is most tap water that's coming out of your faucet is already alkaline, so you don't need alkaline water drops. If you live in the mountains or Arizona, Southern California, Florida, Georgia, Texas, Louisiana, South Carolina, or any other state, your tap water is already alkaline. That is because there is an abundance of alkaline trace minerals present in that tap water in those states, like magnesium and calcium, that naturally boost the pH. Most alkaline water drops are just concentrated minerals, so if you're adding them to your water, you're not accomplishing very much. Even if you live in some northern states like Colorado, where the tap water tends to be more neutral than alkaline, you still don't need to add drops. There are still plenty of alkaline trace minerals in this water, and quite honestly, you get lots of minerals from the food you're eating. So having them in your water isn't that important. If you have really soft water that's acidic, you may consider, it, consider adding minerals to bring up the pH to at least neutral. But using alkaline water drops would be an insanely expensive way to do that. The second reason is alkaline water drops are very expensive. A 1.2 ounce bottle of Alkazone or Alkalife alkaline water drops are about $17 a bottle. If you add three to four drops to an eight ounce glass of water, that bottle will make about 1600 ounces or 12.5 gallons of water. That comes out to $1.36 per gallon of water. Considering that the average person has to drink eight ounces of water every hour until they drink about half of their body weight in ounces a day, that's a very expensive proposition. I'm 260 pounds. I need to drink at least 130 ounces a day to stay hydrated. That means I would need to buy a new bottle of alkaline water drops every 12 days. That's almost three bottles a month or $51 just for drinking water and it's not even filtered. In comparison, a water ionizer makes filtered alkaline ionized water full of antioxidants for only two cents a liter. The third reason why you should avoid alkaline water drops is that they're just an unproven science. Most alkaline water drops only claim to be concentrated alkaline minerals to raise the pH of your water, but some like to claim that they will also add antioxidants to your water. The average American has 1.6 sextillion parts of free radicals built up in their cells at any given time. That means it takes something with billions and trillions parts of antioxidants to make any sort of dent in that number and improve your health. I'm sorry, but even if there are some antioxidants in the three to four drops of solution you add from a bottle of alkaline water drops to your glass of water, there are not billions and trillions of antioxidants in those three to four drops. It's impossible. That's why when it comes to published peer-reviewed research on alkaline water drops, there just isn't any. There are hundreds of published studies on electrolyzed or ionized water from a water ionizer showing it helps with indigestion, arthritis, high blood pressure, or any other condition caused or made worse by free radical damage to our cells. But alkaline water drops do not have any such studies. Some companies will claim that their water is the same as from a water ionizer, but until they can prove it with a published peer-reviewed study, steer clear. So if you're not using alkaline water drops in your water, what should you drink? As I mentioned a couple times already, a water ionizer is a much more solid investment when it comes to getting alkaline water full of antioxidants that's also filtered to 99.99% purity. A water ionizer is an expensive upfront ex investment, but after that, you only have to replace the filters every year or so 
and over its lifespan, the total cost per liter is only about two cents. You can go to research websites like www.pubmed.gov and search for electrolyzed water and you'll find hundreds of published studies. Not only does drinking the alkaline ionized water from a water ionizer make you healthier, the acidic water can be used to naturally sterilize your home, including your kitchen and bathroom. It is even a wonderful natural astringent for your face, cleaning better than any chemical. The uses of the acidic ionized water alone are worth the water ionizer investment. So instead of spending over $50 a month on alkaline water drops per person, consider a water ionizer for your entire family that will significantly reduce free radical damage in your cells and keep your home clean and sterile. Take that water out of its natural source and you put it in a bottle and you stick it on a store shelf, all those ions are going to fizzle out so you're going to lose the most beneficial properties of those water. So the only way to get antioxidant alkaline ionized water in your body is by getting a water ionizer in your home. So I hope that you will take a look at www.waterforlifeusa.com and give us a call if you have any questions.